Alright, here's the day's album of the day. The day I'm gone with Star Castle. Fountains of Light for 1977. This here's Star Castle's second album, following up their self-titled uh, debut album, which was definitely heavily influenced by Yes and Emerson, Lake and Palmer. Second album here still sounds a bit like Yes, but they're making a day in the rain thing, moving towards kind of pomp rock, which would do with a third album, Citadel. But here is their most progressive stuff. The opening track, Fountains, a 10 minute kind of progressive number, really brilliant. Lead singer Terry Lastro still sounds like John Anderson, but it's hard to work out whether he actually sounds like a kind of weedy John Anderson or whether he's just trying to sound like him, and that's the best he can do. Standout performers here, Gary Strater on the bass and Herb Schlitt on the keyboards, the rest of the band pretty competent. But uh, really good stuff on here, Ken Donning of the Day, Silver Winds, Cracking Stuff, Mid-American 70s Pump Rock, check it out. <laughs> 